the virtual reading group that we started at the Hannah Arendt Center has been going on for over six years right now. Every week, usually about 100 people from all over the world come together and read a text of Hannah Arendt's. At a time of a real danger of the breakdown of our common world and our political community, reading Hannah Arendt offers an unparalleled opportunity to think deeply, originally, and freely about how to do politics today. There is something terrific that the virtual reading group uh, provides for people like me. I live in the Dominican Republic, so um, sometimes work make it difficult for us to have in some uh, reading groups. And it's so good to find a place in which you can actually share those ideas. Everybody's listening, everybody's paying attention to you. And that shock of ideas, that crash of ideas, has some epistemic value that actually makes you grow as a person and be more understanding. It reactivated my normative anchor and, and replenished my inspiration, you know, in, in, in politics to engage with others. It really expanded my horizons beyond Arendt. And I think that a time of isolation and this political term, this is very valuable, both, you know, intellectually and personally. Rent is constantly talking about the human and the plural, and that this is what we build our worlds out of. And if we stop even connecting or meeting around a table, around thought, around a text, then the, the purpose for fighting for things kind of dissipates. Having this place to have this conversation in this time has been so valuable, so sanity producing so important you read her and it's you know there's no end <laughs> to the impact that she has i have uh, throughout last year whenever i was allowed to be rehearsing with my company there were times when i would leave the company and go do <laughs> take an hour an hour and a half and be in the virtual reading group at a time when th everything is so superheated feelings are very high she is saying, take your time, think uh, as much as you feel. I believe that the era that we live in and a temperament such as my own benefits from a place where you can go and the, and the rules are slow down. Let's think about everything that we take for granted. Let's think about prejudice. Let's think about um, group action and individual action. Those things are invaluable.